client-based business, you know that attracting the right clients and booking them can be a lot of work. From the initial discovery or sales call to actually getting started on their project, there's so much more than just booking a client and getting paid. Hey guys, Christy here from Dissolve Life, and I'm going to teach you the two tools that you need to onboard and serve your clients faster. Here are a few steps that can help you deliver the best end result for your clients. Steps like your onboarding process. Do you even have one? What does that look like? That looks like after you get off a sales call with them, do you have a proposal contract invoice ready to send within a matter of minutes? Have you gathered all the information you need to send them the things that they need to start the onboarding process and get your project kicked off? The next step would be your project management process. Do you know who on your team is responsible for which parts of the project? Unless you're completely a solopreneur, you realistically have parts of the project that are managed by other team members. Does everyone know when things are due, who's responsible, what steps to take for each of these processes? And the last step is your communication. Does your client know when you're starting the project? Do they know what to expect during the project duration? Are they going to get updates? Are you going to have meetings? Do they know where to go to see mock-ups, updates, progress in general? Do you have a process for asking for reviews or updating payments? Basically, is there any part in your process that your client can ask, okay, what next? If so, that means you haven't communicated clearly enough what your process is like, what's next, and where they can go for help. While all of that sounds like it may be manageable just doing that through email, the truth is having an organized process and the tools doing that work for you in your business is such a game changer. By having a project management tool and a CRM in your business to onboard your clients, you're then able to automate so much of that onboarding process with automations and workflows. You totally impress your new clients because they're able to see you have your stuff together. They know exactly what to expect and have no questions about your process because you're guiding them through it step by step. And it makes it easier for you because you have all of the things you need to complete that project in one place. Our favorite project management tool is ClickUp and our favorite CRM is HoneyBook. We have so many other videos on these two tools, so make sure to check out our channel and subscribe so you don't miss any tutorials on incredible tools for organizing your business. Now I wanna encourage you. Of course, setting up these systems and processes to onboard your clients is gonna take time. It's not gonna happen overnight, but that's why I wanna introduce you to our Systems Roadmap System School. We have incredible courses on HoneyBook, ClickUp, organizing your business with Inbox Zero, and all different mini courses and templates. We have courses and a membership, so check out our system school. I'll put a link in the description below in case you want a step-by-step -step roadmap on these incredible systems to implement in your business. Now, all this might sound great, but sometimes it's hard to grasp what this actually looks like, so I want to guide you through my onboarding process. First, the lead is able to fill out my contact form, which is embedded on my website, that comes straight from HoneyBook. As soon as that lead fills out that contact form, I now have them in my CRM to be able to know what they need, follow up with them, book a call if necessary. Once I do the process of nurturing that lead and then signing them, I upload a workflow after I send the proposal that once that payment is made, they're able to automatically book their kickoff call. From that workflow, one week before the project starts, I have all the tasks I need to do to onboard that client. I upload their ClickUp project template. In that project template, it gives me all of the onboarding steps I have to complete. I create their templated client dashboard for them, send them a client gift, upload all of their project details and prep for their kickoff call, and then I create a custom Loom video walking them through their project, their details, their dashboard, and send everything in a templated, yet personal, HoneyBook welcome email. After I send that email, everything is set 
they have tasks assigned to them that they have to get to me the Friday before our project kicks off. The Monday before, I then prep for our kickoff call, log into all their systems, go through everything that they've provided me to be able to have that kickoff call the next day. This whole process takes about 30 minutes and my client feels extremely nurtured and prepared. You can see from all of those examples, the power that ClickUp and HoneyBook have in that onboarding process. Everything is templated out for me, yet I can go in and personalize things to make sure my client feels nurtured. So I hope this video helped you understand the two tools you need for your onboarding process and why they are so powerful for your business. Not only making you more organized and efficient, but also elevating that client experience. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you can have more organization and client experience tips. And we also have a free onboarding guide that you can use to plug and play into your systems to onboard and gather everything that you need for your clients. I'll make sure to put the link in the description below. With that, I hope this video is helpful and happy organizing.